and reduction. Once the reduction is complete, or only a parallel gap remains, a guide pin is inserted. The starting point for the guide pin is the lateral edge of the capitellar epiphysis on the anterior posterior view, just posterior to the midpoint on the lateral view. The guide pin is positioned appropriately on the lateral condyle and used to manipulate the fracture into position. Usually some gap remains at the fracture site. The cannulated guide pin is driven up the lateral column of the distal humerus and through the opposite cortex. The angle of the pin is perpendicular to the fracture surface and avoids the distal humeral fossa. It's approximately 30 degrees to the long axis of the humerus on the anterior posterior view and 10 degrees to the long axis on the lateral view.